Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depending on the time and location you are tuned to our channel, thanks a lot for the visit. There's a likelihood that there will be disbursement next week, but many of us will be shocked what is going to happen. Many of us will even pray <laughs> that there was no disbursement according to the formation we are gathering. Let's just listen to this uh, Mr. Angel Livia. I don't, I don't like the man really, but it seems he's making a bit sense now. Let's listen to him. We'll see the other side. Let's quickly address the first factor of urgent importance, which is the new sharing formula circulating in the ecosystem. Now, let's break the sharing formula down. Initially, at the beginning, it was 5 million naira that beneficiary is supposed to take home. Later, all the argument and the rest, it was reduced to 3 million. From 3 million, they begged the beneficiary, let us make do 1 million. For 1 million, as at last month, they started talking about something like 300,000. From 300,000, now they are saying something. They are saying might something. have been a way that between Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, there were circulations on the WhatsApp and Telegram groups on new sharing formula where the entitlements of beneficiaries are being reviewed downward. Last month, we were intimated that beneficiaries are going to receive the sum of 300,000 naira and above as entitlement for this grant. Okay. There were jubilations everywhere, even when the money was still meager, considering the economic state we are all finding ourselves. Okay. Then this new uh, rumor in the ecosystem, like the one projected by uh, Osim and other stakeholders in the grant ecosystem, okay. holds that beneficiaries entitlement are currently being refused downward from 300,000 naira to just 100,000 naira. Imagine, imagine 100,000 naira. 100,000 naira. <laughs> Is it? Anyway, let's go on. And one can't help but ask what can 100,000 naira fulfill for a typical Nigerian in this current economic state? Or what meaningful life can 100,000 naira help a subscriber to build? Although it's still a rumor, which I think until we hear from the country director of the UAAG before, we all can believe on this new sharing formula for beneficiaries. But again, since there is a follow-up message to this 100,000 new sharing formula in the WhatsApp and Telegram groups that this is a free money that is coming to Nigerians. The elders are advising the grant subscribers to accept it with good faith. Free and money. Look forward to more productive achievements as the year unfolds. Free money. But again, looking at it critically, this UAAG grant subscription is not actually free per se because I'm aware of different stakeholders that have invested between 10 million to 50 million naira just to achieve this disbursement. I'm equally aware of bundle heads and grant subscribers that have invested between 5,000 to 50,000 or even 200,000 and above just to ensure they secure bundles for themselves. This is the same bundle heads who have been adjusted in status from benefiting from these grants as bundle heads to being beneficiaries <laughs> because these grants mm. have no provision for bundle heads. Imagine. In such instance, these bundle heads who have spent hugely between 2017 till 2024 will now receive a token of 100,000 naira. If it is true, remember this is still a rumor as circulated in the ecosystem. We have tried to reach back to authorities to confirm this rumor. Although some of them obliged has been through, some still insist that until we hear from Apostle Ken before we can adjust to act on this. To me, time and again in the grant ecosystem, most of those rumors always turns to become realities. We barely see rumors that don't necessarily become facts afterwards. Therefore, this can equally be one of those rumors 
that will eventually become realities confronting everyone. Therefore, we can decide to adjust our mindset from millions of naira to mere 100,000 naira, <laughs> if that is going to be the new reality. The good news about this new sharing formula to all bundle heads turn beneficiaries is that those bundle heads that have account details circulated across several NGOs still stand the privilege of receiving millions of naira from this specific disbursement. For example, a beneficiary who holds 10 different account details in one NGO will receive 100,000 times 10 account details that is 1 million naira times 5 different NGOs that is 5 million naira and times 10 different NGOs that implies 10 million naira for such a beneficiary. It's still a win-win for those who have earlier calculated themselves deeply from the onset of this grant activity. Now, being having a criminality, having a criminal mind now is now a calculated, prudent uh, 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 venture. If you want to tell me that this this money was given to Nigeria to make sure that beneficiaries get it, and initially they were using BVN to eliminate any multiple account. What happens to the app? What happens to the to the to the app that they said that the app will eliminate? Uh, multiplicity of accounts oh this this is laughable this is this is unfair and this is annoying now those that wanted to do fraud by multiplying different accounts they are now at the gating end and mind you once these people do this thing beneficiaries may not get why the money is now for a few elites it's just the money is for the escos beneficiaries may not benefit because now he's saying that the bundle head have 100 200 this account which means that that place to those slots that he's putting his own is for beneficiaries as long as he gets a lot of beneficiaries will not get therefore there is no need for expression of disappointment by all parties of subscribers currently why just like the elders say this is a free money it's and a free it's money. stepping stone for startups and business holders in the ecosystem in life anyone that is at the thing for great this money is not for uaag is not for grand escorts it's for the masses it's for beneficiaries now they want to share this money among themselves those in the grant community grant community meaning those in uaag those in ua uh, U, uas and those in uh, agpn they will end up sharing the money among themselves removing the beneficiaries taking bundle head ceo ngo as beneficiaries that is just what they want to do that is why there was a delay tactics when everywhere pipes low they will not do this mischievous act. And Ojo Onjo Olivia is telling me, is telling the masses that it's a win-win situation. It's a win-win situation. Edness will use the little or meager resources in his or her custody to expand to reasonable volumes for success. Just like the parable in the Bible where Imagine. the master gave one, two, three, four, five tokens to different servants it's bringing by back on a journey those with one bundle buried theirs on the ground those with five bundles went to multiply it and have ten bundles or ten coins or tokens as the case may be this is going to be applicable in this grant you can still use the mega resources to expand to millions of naira in few years to come Mega resources, hundred thousand with hundred thousand of up to two bags of rice. Eh? Okay, let's say at the end the person now manage a beneficiary manage to put his name in three accounts. That is three hundred thousand. Which business will three? Will this even be enough to feed? Anyways, uh, <laughs> guys, I'm, I'm carried away. Sorry, I'm carried away. I'm 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 I'm, I'm vest. I'm carried away. 
So that is just the reality we are finding ourselves. That's just the reality we are finding ourselves. So guys, see you on our next update. At this moment, I want to just go and rest and and calm calm my nerves and peace off. See you on our next our next update, guys. See you on our next update. Bye.